my money's on your phone. Yes, I mean, it's a where, 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 where. What up, y'all? Okay, so I have my fourth hour news for you guys. I'm letting you know what's going on in the world. Now, I do have a story that is slightly frustrating. Now, when I do the news, I do the news like I do the news, so I just read through it. But I'm going to uh, go ahead and talk to y'all about it for a second because I'm irritated. It's my last story. Obviously, all the stuff about the coronavirus is here. The new variant, Lambda, uh, Dr. Anthony Fauci, what he's talking about, I'll let you know about all of that. The $1 trillion infrastructure bill, I'll let you know about that. We've been talking about Andrew Cuomo and his top aide resigning after uh, investigations into sexual harassment. But this is what I want to talk about. So Y'all heard about driving while black, right? Uh, Ahmad Aubrey taught us about jogging while black, right? Well, we got a new one to add to the list. It's called house shopping while black. And no, I'm not just talking about the fact that they raise prices and make it much more difficult for us to buy homes. But uh, officers in the city of Wyoming, Michigan, handcuffed a black real estate agent, his clients... The client's 15-year-old son, after neighbors called the police about three suspicious black men. Now, the police say race was not a factor, but how you going to house hunt without looking at the house? And how you help being black? Like, I'm si I, like must we wear masks now when we house hunting? This is absolute crazy. And I'm going to say it just like that. Just so you know, we're not sugarcoating nothing. Driving while black, jogging while black, and now house hunting while black. What up, bro? I'm here. They talk about races and the fact that race is. What's up, Goldie Lock? Prettiest lady with locks there is. I don't know if y'all follow her or anybody that's a part of the Lock Nation. Y'all need some inspiration from a beautifully locked lady. Goldie Locks is the shiznit. I've been following her for quite some time. Just looking for people with unique lock journeys. And uh, she's super dope. Super duper dope. So what's up, baby girl? Grand rising, rich rising, and the wealthy rising to you this morning. Uh, you about to go into this news. Y'all ready? I'm ready. It's the front page on the Ricky Smiley Morning Show. Oh, yeah. It's 26 minutes after the top of the hour. Front page is in the mix. Eva Fashiba. What's up there, girl? Good morning, Rock. Good morning, everyone, and happy Monday. I'm your girl, Eva Marcel, here with a quick look at your front page news. New coronavirus cases in the U.S. are nine times higher higher than they were in February, and hospitals are filling up across the country. The New Orleans Jazz Fest has been canceled this fall due to COVID-19, and with case numbers at an all-time high in Florida, school districts are battling with state officials over mask mandates. Meanwhile, Dr. Anthony Fauci said that he is hopeful the FDA will give full approval to Pfizer, Moderna, and Johnson & Johnson coronavirus vaccines by the end of the month. Meanwhile, some Scientists are keeping a close watch on the Lambda variant of the virus. Now, in other news, the Senate is one step closer to passing the $1 trillion infrastructure bill. A vote to pass could come as early as tonight. Meanwhile, the top aide to New York Governor Andrew Cuomo resigned yesterday, just days after an investigation found that Cuomo sexually harassed 11 women. And last but certainly not least, in a very frustrating piece of the news, now we've all heard about driving while black, right? We've heard about jogging while black due to Ahmaud Aubrey. Well, we have something new to add to the list. It's called house shopping while black. Officers in the city of Wyoming, Michigan, handcuffed a black real estate agent, his client, and his client's 15-year-old son after neighbors called the police about three suspicious black men. Police say race was not a factor. All right, that was a quick look at your front page news. For more, log on to the Ricky Smiley Morning Show.com. Rock teasy bo sheezy. All right. So sad. So sad. This house hunting white black got me feeling the way. Because I bought my house almost three years, about two and a half years ago. And uh, I looked at about 60 houses. And I can't imagine the police being called on me and my children, and my husband, for looking at a house. 
And it's really sad, Big Daddy Sunshine, that the response is they ain't die, though. Because dying should not even be a factor in house hunting. About to spend hundreds of thousands of dollars. But uh, I digress. I love you, black man. Y'all are beautiful. Y'all are golden. Y'all are deserving. Y'all are worthy. Y'all are not properly respected, but I love you. I respect you if nobody else does. Period. Y'all kings, okay? In this jungle of crazy people, y'all are kings. Period. Know that. Hold your head high and don't let your crown tilt, baby. All right, black people, y'all golden. Everybody else, y'all good too. Y'all be a blessing to each other. Be a blessing to yourself. Be good to yourself. Um, and yeah, I'm about to go get in the shower, so I'm gonna get a massage. A little self-care. All right, y'all be good. Bye.